Hey y'all, how is everything going? I hope all is well with you. So what you doing while you're sitting home? I'm going to ask y'all questions. So what you doing? You enjoying your time off? I hope you ain't worrying about keep looking at all the advertisement and news about the coronavirus virus because we know about the virus again. So it's not much we can do but try to stay away from it, right? So moving on, what do you do when you're home? Play with the kids more, play with mama more, oh, or whatever. Do you take more naps and everything? What you do? Comment down below what you do. Comment down below? Comment down below in the comment section what you do when... Comment you down below what you do. Okay. I'm asking you questions. You don't really have to comment. You just answer the question. Say, yeah, I'm going to sit back and relax. I'm going to enjoy this time off. I'm going to get paid for it anyway, so I'm going to just sit back and relax. How often do I get you time off? You don't do that when you're in that YouTube Okay, show. that's not what you want to do while I'm shooting this movie. I'm just saying. Okay, you don't you really want to sit here and debate with me. Okay, I, I know I don't usually say comment down, comment down below. You need to say comment down below. Okay, so she said, what, push like and comment down below? No. and subscribe, like, Subscribe, comment. like, and comment down to below. I'm sorry. I misinterpreted that. what she was saying. I'm sorry. That's what you're supposed to do when you have a YouTube channel. You know what I'm saying? Wee! I'll see y'all later. No, you don't do that. You tell them subscribe and like. Really? Subscribe and like. Okay. Subscribe and like. Okay, tell them. Subscribe. Subscribe and like to this video. Subscribe, like, comment, subscribe in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. To my channel. Oh. That's exactly what you said. Oh, that's what you say. Well, subscribe and like. Five, four, three, two, one, and comment to my channel. But you know what I'm gonna do today? I'm gonna look over this census. And I think the census is important. A lot of people don't, but they feel like they don't want to take the time out of it. It might take up to forty minutes to do. So really you probably wouldn't just um Okay, let's do it like that. You probably wouldn't just um, do the census all at one time. But the census is made because of the fact what they do is they say they got $675 billion for things like schools, hospitals, and it's for the neighborhoods um, around all over the world to keep up with how many people here and what they may need here because there's more people here and more people there. $675 billion they put up a year to do things like build new schools and hospitals in your area, recreation centers for the kids, school programs. That's why you can, if you put in a bid for something, uh, say you wanted a recreation center, you put in a proposal for a recreation center. Well, that's where you go. They got money here for that. So that's where you go. And when you fill out the census, it lets you know what type of area you're in, whether it's full of kids or very few kids and so on and et cetera, et cetera. So in that case, it is important to fill it out and let be known that you're here. You know what I mean? Um, be counted for the be here. Because they're not going to know if you don't fill out a census report. It's like a record of how many people is in the world today. That's what I get out of it. Can you calm that down a little bit until I finish? Okay. Um, so, I'm going to do it. I'm going to sit back Why I ain't got nothing to do. Well, truthfully speaking, I got something to do because normally I'm in my recording studio every day. I'm home anyway. So it's not hard for me to stay home. But I have Unique here with me all through the day. So being though she's here all through the day, it's a little different because I got to entertain her somewhat. You know, I just can't go down to my studio and stay and come up and take a nap and wait till she get out of school and bring her home. And, and then I got to entertain her all day. So it's different. But yeah, but they got questions in here with the census and it's asking them on where you live, I think, and what type of rent you pay. You know, no crazy questions, I hope. I haven't been through it yet, but I'm going to check it out. 
And if I have any type of issue with it, I'm going to call you back. It asks you what race you are, you know, stuff like that. Um, how is this person related to you? If you have a second person living in your house, they got to pay for that. A fourth and a fifth and a sixth and a seventh and a eighth. And then they ask you about your housing situation. I'm just going to ask a couple questions. Last month was, what was the cost of electricity for this house, apartment, or mobile home last month? Okay, so you just put down what your bill was last month. You know, in the past 12 months, what was the cost of water and sewage for this house, apartment? So you put down whatever you paid for the water bill. And see, they get programs because there's programs out there, and I'm almost sure through the census that they're able to have the money for the program to make it work for us. And I'm looking into it myself because now my landlord's going to change landlords. So my landlord at first paid my water bill, but now they don't pay my water bill, so I have to pay the water bill, which can be expensive, especially if you're on a low income. So therefore... They got a program out that pays 40% or something like that. For, I'm going to say 40% at least towards your water bill, which is a big help. So that's what that's what the census is about. You know, they ask you about your housing situation and, you know, let me see one more question before I let y'all go. But I would look into it because if you got the paper and you ain't doing nothing anyway, it gives you something to do. Then you go to my YouTube station and listen to some of my mess and, and, and um, listen to some of my music and enjoy the rest of your day. Then you play some games with the kids, right? Go and tease grandma or grandpa or your husband. Yay, it's time to stay home. We getting paid. Since you got a lot to be happy for. No doubt about it. We do. And that's the way to look at it. So, yeah. Why are you doing nothing? Check out the census because, because the census is for you. Check it out. Knock it out. Do it. It ain't going to hurt you. It can only help you. You know, you never know what program you might need help from. And to know that it's programs, and truly, it's a program almost out there for every little thing that's going on that you might have problem with dealing with. Believe me. You just got to do your homework and find them. And that's where the census come in. That's where the census come in. So people be good, be safe, take one day at a time who loves you and do the census, do the census, do the census, yay. Oops, come on with this. So do the census, we, we, we. Oh, that's not mine anyway. Hey, yeah, it's, it's it's like no name on it. You know what I mean. And I think I picked it up, so. Hey, what can I say? Anyway, do the census. Have a blessed one one day at a time. And who loves you, baby? We.